Hello, this is Jack, sometimes known as Old Man Babe. Now last night I gave you the uh, preview of Savon France e-liquid line. Um, I was wrong about one thing. The, uh, uh, the girl that goes like that and she says, you know, blonde girl and all that. It's I like vape line, okay, which is also a part of Savant. They didn't send me any of that. They, they sent me some hips, some Ben Northen, and some bang, okay, and I thought it was bang. This is what bang looks like. Oh, yeah. Um, right now, I'm I'm vaping on some uh, this right here in my Valkyrie. What I did was I uh, made up a lot of different RDAs here and uh, so I can test them but you know this is probably going to be a couple of reviews just to get all this in so I hope you bear with me. All right. Um, there's a lot of ju good juice companies out there and I, I kind of split them up into you know three major categories there's a very very inexpensive cheap uh, juice lines that you know you taste them and you go oh my god this is terrible why am I vaping this or you might say huh this ain't too bad but then you go up into an intermediate one and you go oh my god this is great. Now those two are, you know, one level up above the other. The the other ones, you know, they have the aftertaste. They have this. They, you know, don't last with you very long. Now the intermediate ones are the ones that they're good, okay, but they seem to copy each other. You know, I mean, somebody gets a a juice that becomes real popular then everybody else starts doing that juice there's nothing definitive to make it exclusively their own they even they even you know have similar names and, and all that stuff but they're good juices you know they're okay a few uh, all day ones but you know they're good juices and then you got the juice company that's all their own I mean they stand out and they're all their own and there could be ten of those juice companies and they don't taste like the other juices they're not packaged like the other juices they are their own juice now Savon uh, France e juice uh, they got and I'm sure they got more than four lines but they sent me three of them and all three of these lines are different so it's it's hard to to uh, you know review them at the same time um, this hips okay uh, they, they sent me um, four of them okay uh, right here on my Valkyrie I'm uh, I'm vaping on what they call original okay now hips has this here let me show you and it, it, they have this you know magician looking guy you know French they're so you know dramatic but any rate um, and uh, and they package it real well and all that now this original is supposed to be like a a, a vanilla custard uh, all that they creamy smooth with the aromatic intensity of vanilla custard it's like a vanilla custard but this is interesting because the other night when I was trying some of these out I put some original in here And uh, my daughter, well, daughter-in-law, 
girlfriend's daughter, whatever she is, Megan, comes out of her bedroom and, you know, she was doing her hair and all that. And she comes out of the bedroom and she goes, oh, that smells good. Who's making popcorn? And I start thinking about it. This stuff smells like that good, good buttery popcorn that, uh, that's fantastic, you know. Could I vape this all day? The only reason why I might have trouble vaping this all day is because they sent me zero nicotine and I'm more like a, a six, uh, a six nicotine. I can do three, but six is what I usually vape. But, you know, to get the real true flavor and all that is zero, I could have some friends of mine, you know, make this into a six. But right now, I'm just doing it at zero nicotine and yes, I could vape this all day long. All right. Oh yeah. I'm in the movie theater. I'm eating some, you know, you get that juice on you, but I'm eating some buttery popcorn and and all that no you know the only bad thing about this is the kids go can I have some I want some popcorn where's your popcorn at I can't find your popcorn but this is good stuff you know these are all one-of-a-kind juices you know and yeah you can have your favorites out there and all this other stuff but gotta try this this is great stuff. And the other one that I'm doing by hips, they sent me four. Now I'll get to the other two in just a second. And this other one is, if you could see that, must. Oh, do you notice something? Mm-hmm, yeah. They put the label on upside down or I'm supposed to hold it like this. Either way, this doesn't matter how they put the label on. They, it's good juice. This is the way they describe these things. I mean, why don't they just say it instead of you know putting all this other stuff down? But for those who insist on caramel, the first breath evokes a delicate cooked sugar which softens its curves over a bed of biscuits gourmet yes heavy no okay this is a caramel sugar kind of cookie kind of thing and i'm doing that on my yes my swag rda yes my skelly See? And that juice there is totally different than the original, okay? Uh, you don't get those similar tastes. They're all uniquely their own, okay? Now, all right, this is Okay, let me let me come over here to Okay. Border. Vivid notes of licorice identify the original vapor at is and it is carried on by a messenger flavored by mint and spices. Freshness, sweetness, and bitterness. An elixir of long life. Now you suppose this means something different in French and they just translated it and it comes out kind of wacky you know and like I said before how they describe their flavors you know it's kind of romantic I mean hell the French had a kiss named after them. so and, oh there's my girlfriend I told her I was making a video she said oh stay home and make video where nobody can bother you so she likes to call me why i'm what 
making a video. I love her. Well, we're coming, you know, pretty close to the time when we got to stop. But just bear me some mind here, okay? This here is Borders, okay? And this is the one I... Look at this. Look at that green. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and it is green. All right. Uh, and it does. It tastes like that licorice... That licorice... Um, can you guys hold it up a little bit? That licorice candy you used to get with that little taste of anise in it like that. You know, it's like a liqueur. You know, you, you when somebody gives you a liqueur, especially a really, really fine liqueur, you don't want to like guzzle it. Well, I did when I was a drunk, but you don't want to guzzle it. You want to take fine little sips. So, could I vape this all day? Even if it had six mix in it, I I don't think I could. Simply, it's not that it's not delicious. It's just that it's so rich and oh and they're right the flavor does stay with you for a long time but not like an aftertaste it stays with you and it's good and your mouth stays cool and all that so you really got to kind of like the mini licorice kind of thing and if you don't give it a try anyway just you know try it and uh, you know this is like a uh, late afternoon uh vape you know with your friends hanging out would you like a little liqueur with your vape oh this is this is good stuff i mean this is really good stuff Now, bear with me a little bit, okay? I'm going to take this off. Yes, the elusive swag RDA. And I'm going to put on a turbo, although, you know, that little fan they have in there, I think mine stopped working. But, you know, what the hell, it still is a good RDA. Oh, let me take that off and, yeah. We're going to hit on some dragon now. And, you know, this, this stuff is good, too. Now, dragon is a lemon revisited by an ultra, ultra cool swab seasoned lightly with anise and mint. The unusual dragon leads to a hidden garden of citrus blossom, herbs, and intoxicating spices. Oh yeah, and it does just that. Alright, we're going to put a little bit on here. And this stuff, I mean, if you can't wake up in the morning, okay, this is a little side note, one of the little benefits. you got to get to work early like I do. Alright, a little bit of this in your RDA. Oh yeah, that will wake you up. So, I just did borders, okay? Or, I just did hips, all right? Remember hips with this guy on there? Ooh. Uh, now, they only sent me four. They have probably a lot of other ones, but I just did the, the border and the dragon, okay? Which is the... Fine, the cool of it's like oh, I, it's hard to describe. There's nothing out there. I was gonna say it's like a desserty thing, but it's it's not really. It's like a liqueur. Yeah, I don't know how else to put it. Okay, and then must, which is that caramel thing, but it's so much more. And then we're at the movies with uh, with this original, and I'm telling you. I really 
people like it. On our next review, we'll be looking at Ben Norton, and I got a lot to say about him. But until then, this is Jack, and with all my love, and Gary, you guys, you got hooked up with one hell of a juice company, and you know, I'm going to put the email on here, and you know, hopefully people will email you, but I've already got a lot of people PMing me back about they got to try this juice. So I'm giving them your email address. And, you know, Gary, thank you very much for hitting me up with this. It's, it's, this is good juice. Uh, everybody, I love you. Keep vaping. I enjoy it, and I hope you enjoy these uh, videos, and I'll be making another one short. Thank you very much. This is Jack, wishing you all a good night.